There's a unique working group with experts from all over the world, and it's really a privilege to chair this group. And uh, we are going to build a bridge between the standard of perioperative care, which is called ERAS, Enhanced Recovery After Surgery, as a plan A, and uh, a plan B for those patients having risks for malnutrition and uh, having complications uh, in the perioperative period. Yes, uh, the guideline is nice to have, but it needs to be implemented in clinical practice. And this is a task for all and uh, for uh, ESPEN as well, who is promoting a lot these uh, guidelines. And um, we are very happy to have those apps available, which are very feasible for clinical practice. Yeah, we brought in the Zacopinia frailty issue, which characterizes high-risk patients uh, even more. And uh, there is a new concept of prehabilitation over four to six weeks for those high-risk patients. And uh, it, there's a lot of uh, clinical studies and evidence during the past few years. So we could go for a recommendation of prehabilitation in high-risk patients.